Yo, 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 yo. What's up, what's up, what's up? Nah, 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 nah. You know what it is, guys. Got another StarCraft cast case for you guys. And this is some very, very recent stuff. You're going to see Jose versus Buell. Played on Sunday. Casting this on Sunday. But I think I will post it maybe Monday or Tuesday or something like that. Um, and... I'm going to have three games. I'm going to do the first two, and then I'll do the last one. And we'll see how these play out. I mean, Buell has been absolutely dominating. The SCW season is ending at the end of uh, this week. So, not this Sunday, but next Sunday. And... There's a lot of good, good players in there. So we got, I mean, I don't know if anyone's going to be able to beat Buell. He just seems like he's just been dominating so much. Um, his record's insane. Uh, but he hasn't really played any, I mean, he hasn't played like Gold SCV. But yeah, let me just give you guys a little rundown of who's going to be playing. I think it's the top 10, I want to say. It could be top 8. But let me just take a look at here. So we have Gold SCV, Hydra, Momo, uh, also known as Vulture, who is sneakily good, I think. You got Jose, Dingo, you got Thanks, and then uh, Think Fast is up here. Def Jam, Buell, and Riddick. So Joe's going to make top 10, possibly. So very, very interesting. Going to go two racks into a refinery. Um, so I don't know how the structure of the tournament is going to be. There's 420 bucks on the line, and yeah, it's going to be, it is going to be good. I mean, you got Gold SCV, Buell, Hydra, uh, I mean, Dingo Jose, they're always good, these guys. Here's your Zergling's going to pop out. Gonna build that factory right in the middle, it looks like. There it is. So we'll see what Jose goes for here. And we got Stim getting upgraded. Gonna build another gas. And is he. Gonna pump out two medics. Gonna start moving these guys on up. Wants to make sure. Yeah, doesn't want to lose anything here, but wants to make sure he's not gonna be able to just keep pushing out these sunkins like this. And Jose, in my opinion, has a very, very strong ZVT. I think he has one of the few ZVTs where he can beat players like Buell. Um It's rare, but it's he's probably the only player. Take this guy out. Nice. And uh, he's gonna go right into Hydros right here, so timing's gonna be a little bit off. Didn't need to get that as soon. Here's your engineering bay. We'll see if he gets the upgrade or if he just lifts this up. Looks like he's gonna lift this up, get some information. Got Siege on the way, so I mean just an extremely fast push. Got another Barracks on the way right here. And I mean just the Micro Macro is just going to be on point. So he's going to see this and I'll probably start building turrets right here. I'm a little interested to see how he's going to handle being up against. I mean, so you got some Hydras right here, so doesn't know if he's going to be up against Lurkers or... A ton of hydras. This actually might go down. We'll see if he tries to save it. I think he will try to save this. We'll probably bring an SCV over here and repair this. And then he'll move it on over. We'll see if that's what he does. There's your SCV. 
I'm gonna get that upgrade done. And there's your tank sieged up. And we got a little attack action. guys up and slowly bulldozing with through here so doing a pretty nice job no lurkers on the way and already has a hive on the way but this is gonna go down and we will see the control and take out that overlord you got this overlord as well, so just extremely, extremely annoying. Getting that upgrade turret coming down. I try to take out maybe another overlord. He's got range. Yeah, a Def Jam. I mean, he is going to be someone that can take some games off some players, take a series possibly. I mean, he might even be able to win it. I need mean, all these players can win it the right matchups and you win a couple he's got I'm gonna keep pumping out the drones there's just one tank right here he's pumping off just the one factory sending these guys on in this is not looking good Your lurkers, though. I'm gonna burrow these guys up. Scan gonna come down. He's gonna try to take this out. It's at one. Take out the second. Lurkers over here. This guy gonna burrow just in time. There's another lurker. Oof, can get taken out. I feel like if they made lurkers burrow a little bit quicker. It would help. Obviously, it would help, but I think I—I uh, I wouldn't mind if that was a thing. Just throw a little bit quicker, and I think you are gonna have this one. I want to check out his base after this. There's a vessel coming in here as well, gonna seal the deal. That guy's gonna go down. A couple hatcheries back here. There's your re. And we are going to see, let's just check out the base. Getting a radiate. Eight minutes was this game. Upgrade, almost done. And getting another gas. We'll see what this APM was. Pump it off of three racks. I mean, it's just a, it's just such a, he's just so clean with this Terran. So going to win that one. I did do a game of Buell versus Meppo TVP and Meppo is something else, that's for sure. I think that guy can become the best Protoss player. In my opinion. I mean he might be able to become the best player. I mean, that guy is good. He is extremely, extremely good. So we're going to see Jose on the Protoss here, and Buell on the Terran. to a mech build you don't see this often I have not been seeing him go for the mech build early on and he's scouting right after the depot so I'm gonna scout the middle and Nexus and I think I mean uh, in my opinion I think Jose's Protoss has gotten better he's just gonna scout the chokes right now 
your forge. So playing it safe, he's not going to go gateway. And here's your marine on the way. And he's going to actually get the scout off. This guy's going to be somewhat annoying. going to have to pull some probes to kill this guy. And he's got another marine over here. I don't think he realizes... Gonna be able to kill this cannon. You got some good shots off on that. Here's your mer uh, probes coming on the marine. Sending in another marine, but those cannons are gonna be done. He actually might lose these. Are you just gonna pull that back? He's just too good for that. And gonna try to get this probe in the way. She does. Get that shot off. But he's got five probes just idled. This guy gonna be extremely, extremely annoying. Guess not. Not as annoying as I thought he was going to be. Lifting this up, and we'll see if he just goes right into tanks. Probably two vultures and then two tanks. And for me, I think Jose probably should go with Dragoons here. Maybe speed. I mean, this is such a tough... I guess DTs is probably the way to go, but I mean, his tech is a little bit slow. So, this is your probe. Looks like he's going to go for an expo. You should get that cyber down. And went right into a tank. No siege. So, interesting. I would think you would want to go with siege. His guess it seems like it's been a little bit slow right now. I think he's waiting for that 150 so he can get this siege. There it is. I guess it, if he's going with Dragoons, it doesn't really matter how quickly your Cyber is. I guess it does a little bit if you want to pump out more Dragoons. Here's a little Expo though. And Tank is going to use this kind of just to wall off. We're going to see an extremely fast Siege. And I think Jose is going to just try to buy himself time and go with this Expo drop. And Vultures are going to go scouting for this Expo. He saw that probe out there, so he has an idea. And another factory going to come down. Let's see if he goes over here looking for it doesn't see it yet tank is sieged up and he did that little damage on this cannon so we gonna look up here and we'll see if he spots out this expo here's your expo right here looks like it's gonna be maybe a DT expo which I think is a good move and it is not gonna get spotted out so tanks are rolling in he's gonna keep building these cannons Let's see if he's getting speed not yet. I mean, this push is just so fast. And he needs to build cannon here, cannon here, and cannon here. Gonna start moving on in. You see those units? Pretty good job there by Jose. This brain gonna go down. Gotta be careful. Don't want to. Actually, he should be going for this attack. Both are gonna come in. He's trying to take out one of these tanks, but he's not gonna be able to. And he's just gonna bring in an SCB. These guys might just run on in, come on down, go after the probes. I think we should take out this cannon. And I think DTs are going to be getting made right now. There's your DTs. Here's your mines getting laid. This is going to be interesting. I don't know. We should build a couple pylons right here. Kind of wall this off. Sending these guys, he's got the mines, taking out that tank. DT should be almost done. Let's see if he's got these guys railed into the base. Are these guys railed, they are. No engineering bay, no command center. Tanks are rolling in. Here's your DTs. I mean, these DTs can save the day. Here's your vultures. And this guy just gonna keep running on out. Get that swipe off on this guy. Take this guy out. What's he gonna do here? How is he gonna? There goes your tank. This guy gonna go down. 
Needs to move the probes. You got the DTs in here, moving them to the right side. Takes out a decent amount. These guys are coming on the other side. You got DTs in here. This is crazy. Let's just get. I mean, these guys are in here. He's got nothing really. Where'd those DTs go? Use this DT. He's got that DT. Here's your turrets coming down. Laying the mines. Gonna take out that DT. Just using these guys to just kind of clip this. Here's your DT right here. Another DT right here. And I gotta pause this. Sorry guys. The pizza guy just got here. This is crazy though. Probes. He's got. He's down to seven probes, and now the turrets are established. More DTs are coming, and vultures. Gonna lay some more mines. Here's your DTs, and I think Fuel is gonna have this one. Taking up more probes. This was a pretty sick game though. He lifted this up. Repairing that, he tried to take that out. He got three DTs on the way, no DTs. And, I mean he's down to nine probes. What a performance from both players. I mean, I like this expo idea. It was so close to getting spotted out. Here's your vultures coming on in. And... You're going to pull this one off. Probably got some tanks getting made. GG McGee, good game. Command center. Um, and then I'll do the third game in a last. Uh, in another cast. So, yeah, what do you guys think of Buell? Is Buell going to be unbeatable this season for the tournament? He's in the top 10. Uh, went 2 0 right here. You guys will see the third game. And, um, yeah, so. Give it a like, subscribe. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. You know what it is.